I'm working on McCall 7831 and I want to make this view but I do want to lengthen it and I am also adding a front pocket and I'm using the pocket pattern piece from this Simplicity 9700 jumpsuit. Now the front piece was connected. This was all one solid piece but because I want to add a pocket I did separate the upper portion of the front pattern piece so I cut a line and separated it. I added seam allowance to both pieces here and here. What I want to do is take the pocket, add it, then when I get ready to sew the front pieces back together then the pocket will be enclosed. I also needed to add a facing to the pocket piece so that it will have a neat finish. Here is the facing stitched to the pocket piece. I did some understitching and then this will be folded in and then I will be able to place this on the front of the dress and then I'll have my pocket. I did serge around the raw edge of the pocket here and down here and I was going to fold it in and do a narrow hem but I like the way the serged stitches look so I'm just going to leave it as is and just top stitch over it and I am using two different shades of denim. I have two brown threads and two white threads in my serger. The buckle that I'm using is one and five eighths of an inch wide and this is how it looks. I feel like I could have used a buckle that is not as wide but this was all I could find at the store. I used the lengthen and shorten line on the pattern in order to lengthen the pattern. However, I did add two inches to the front and back side seam so that the dress would be able to go over my hips without it being too tight. And this is a learn to sew pattern and it was really pretty easy. I don't know if you all are familiar with Le Creuset. I think that's how you said it. it's a French name, but they make cookware. And I found out that they have an outlet store and I'm on my way to the outlet store. I already have one of their pots with the lid and I love it. It's like cast iron, but it's coated and they come in these beautiful colors. I'm actually in line to get some gas. But yeah, I cannot wait to go to the outlet. I've never been and I wanna see what they have because the one pot that I do have, I ordered it online. So I'm actually gonna go in the store and check out their inventory and see if I can come away with some nice, pretty, pretty pot. I'm wearing the Simplicity Cargo skirt and I made this a while ago, but this is my first time actually wearing it. So I'll put a link to this skirt if you're interested in seeing the video that I did when I was making it. Do I have some at home? Yes. I actually do. I have like this one right here. And it's my first time in the store so I wanted to get another pot if possible because I love the one that I have. What color one do you have right now? I have this one. Oh, so you have a small, oh, you have I have a this small one. Dash. Yes. This is usually the one I recommend. It's kind of in the middle. Um, and so the brazers are a little bit more bowed, if you can see that. Okay. Um, I love that color. This is one of the originals. Wow. Um, these two actually are. Okay. Oh, and you have that pretty lavender type of color? And that is Provence. Okay. 
There's our last one. I did. How it's did you gorgeous. know? No, I used to design clothes. Yeah, it's great. It's a great piece. Thank you. I decided I'm going to get this and I'm going to get a lid to go with it. Oh, I was in that store for so long trying to figure out what I wanted to get. But I'm really happy with my purchase and I even like the bag. It's super cute and it happens to match the pot that I ended up picking up. Years ago, my mom told me that Applebee's had some really good brownies and I'm craving an Applebee's brownie. So I told my husband I wanted to stop by an Applebee's. So I think that's what we're about to do. We have some other things to do, so I'm getting ready to go out. But in the meanwhile, while we're out, that's what I want to do is get a brownie. I was sitting around talking to one of my family members and we were talking about things that we didn't know existed. And I was telling him that I did not know that there is a such thing as a pre-K, as in pre-kindergarten, prom. I was so shocked when I found that out. And then he shared with me that there is a such thing as National Handcuff Day. So I was like, what? So yeah. We had a good time just sitting and talking about things that we didn't know existed. Just blew my mind. It is pretty warm out here. Oh, I know I'm not gonna need this jacket. What? You hear them yelling? Oh, they're happy though. Oh, when you hear somebody yelling, you don't know if it's happy or mad or scared or what, but yeah, they sound like they're happy, whoever that is. No, I'm sorry. Oh, with oh, and with no ice cream, by the way. Okay. Anything else for you? No, that'll be it. Okay. Thank you. My pleasure. Okay. Bye bye. Thank you. Have a nice evening. You too. Thanks a lot. They gave me ice cream anyway, even though I asked for no ice cream. And here are the brownie bites. They're so little. They're really cute. So that's why I wanted two of them. It's really good, you guys, if you ever want to try it out. Applebee's Brownie Bites. A few hours later, <laughs> a knock sounded on the door. Marriott. Uh, are you reading for it? Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm going to read like I used to do back in the day. Yeah, no. You don't want me to? Mm. Come on now. Okay, ready? A few hours later, a knock sounded on the door. Marielle didn't bother to get up from her undress. Somebody knocked on the door here. <laughs> You're not listening. I'm trying to read you a story. Come on. Mm -hmm. A few, huh? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No I used to read stories to him when we first started dating. <laughs> no, not when we were dating. Bro. When was it? <laughs> no. After we got married? No. When was it? It when had we to were... be one or the other. No, it didn't happen. I did too. You know, if you would have been reading stories to me when we was dating, I would have been like, girl. <laughs> you know that we would be in the car and I would have my book and I'd be reading you the book. I'd be listening to you. Whatever. You know, I used to read you books all the time because then you would be wanting to know what happened. <laughs> yeah. You would. You'd be like, what happened with that one story? And then I have to give you the update. Facts. <laughs> 